savings and investments. Renowned economist Robert Kiyosaki, in his best-selling book, Rich Dad, Poor Dad, says, One of the important differences between the rich and the poor is that they, the rich, don't just work for money. They use their money to work for them. This is one thing that sets the rich apart from the poor. Whether it is saving or investing, there is a clear motive behind them and that is financial security for the future. But both the concepts of saving and investment are believed to be the same. We often hear elders saying, save money, save money. But nobody ever says, invest or increase wealth and assets. Even today, the common people do not understand the difference between saving and investing. Any savings that are made are considered investments, but they don't increase wealth and assets and do not raise the standard of living. So it is extremely important to understand the fundamental difference between saving and investing. Saving is the process of setting aside a certain amount every month. Investing is the process of increasing the amount saved. After taking care of the total monthly expenses and paying off all the loans, when a certain amount of money is set aside for emergencies or the future, it is known as savings. When the saved money or the money received from the returns or the wealth created is used for the purchase of such property that is likely to give safe and huge returns after a long period of time, it is known as investment. The saved money can be readily available at any time and the rate of interest is low. An immovable property can be created from the money invested, so the financial benefits are not readily available. But the amount of return is very large. When money saved is deposited in such a way that it yields returns less than or equal to the rate of inflation, it is called savings. When money is invested in such a way that it gives higher returns than the rate of inflation, it is called investment. Even though the returns on savings are less than or equal to the rate of inflation, it does not mean that it is wrong. When the savings period is less than 3 years, it is always better to save in such a scheme. Investing in any plan for less than 3 years is like not getting any returns from that investment. When the investment period is more than 3 years, then means of savings cannot be relied upon. When done consistently and regularly, savings can be accumulated and converted into investments. However, it is very important to know the difference between them and know for how long to save and when to convert it into an investment. Savings means are FD, RD, bank deposits, etc. And investment means are equity funds, hybrid funds, stocks, bonds, real estate, etc. that give good returns.